Hey, I'm Lindsay, and I'm going to show you how to make the best damn margarita at home with just a few simple ingredients. Fresh limes, ah. Cointreau, beautiful triple sec, hey. good quality tequila, ah. some ice, I'm all good like this. and a shaker set. It's all you need. Set up your shaker tins. Three quarters of an ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. This is key. Fresh citrus is the best thing you can do for your cocktails. Next, you're going to grab a quality triple sec. Cointreau is the original in the margarita. Don't fuck around with it. One ounce. And finally, pick a good quality tequila. Some people like to use a Blanco, a silver tequila. Others like a Reposado. So play around with both and see which one you prefer. And it's one and a half ounces of tequila. Oh yeah. And grab a glass of your choice. I'm gonna have a little rocks glass here. And then fill this shaker tin up about three quarters of the way with ice. Seal that off and give it a good, vigorous shake. Crack that open. And then I'm going to use a technique that I love. It's called a dirty dump. Just gonna get the drink into the glass as quickly as possible. We don't need to find strain or strain at all. Rather, the margarita isn't a super fancy drink, so just get it from the tin into the glass. Maybe top that off with another piece of ice or two. Garnish with a lime smiley. And you can add salt to the rim. I didn't today, and there you have it. The best damn margarita. Side note, skinny margarita is bullshit. Agave nectar, yes, it's favorable for the skinny margarita. People think that it's low on the glycemic index, so it must be better for them. Wrong. It is high, high, high in fructose, higher than high fructose corn syrup. Just make your margarita this way. Keep it simple, keep it classic. You can't go wrong. Now it's time to level up. This is a strawberry serrano pepper infused tequila. Fun fact, you can infuse tequila with anything. Today, we're doing strawberries and serrano chili peppers because they're delicious together. A little sweet, a little spicy. Take one bottle of tequila, one basket of strawberries, chop them up, put them together, and then with the serrano pepper, start small. I would start with a half a pepper. Let it sit in here for a few hours and start to taste it. You can always add more. You can never dial back. For my fruit infusions, I like to wait a minimum of 24 hours. You can go longer, shorter if you want, but just taste it as you go. And when you taste it and you like it, then it's ready. So we're going to make this strawberry spicy margarita for a bunch of people. All we're going to do is take our measurements in the single serving from ounces and bring that up to cups. Grab a measuring cup. Three quarter cups of lime juice. Next, we have one cup of Cointreau. And finally, one and a half cups of our infusion. Pretty. Right. Add ice. And blend. <laughs> We're not making soup. All righty, beautiful, vibrant pink. Add a couple straws, a garnish. Delicious, that's the fucking drink.